Now return to Let's Play Pharaoh, A New Era. We're going to Sawu. As soon as it loads. Any day now. Now that Egypt is firmly united under your rule, we must develop trade relations with cities throughout the world to increase Egypt's wealth, O king of the two lands. As your people prosper, they demand more exotic items. Tired of jewelry and easily obtained luxury goods, your people want rare and expensive luxury goods, such as incense. Your court and I, your trusted vizier, recommend that you establish a Red Sea port at Sawu. Sawu offers a trade route to distant Quent, from which the finest incense in the world may be imported, though at great cost. Besides some modest veins of gold and copper ore, Sawu produces few raw materials of its own, but can thrive as a manufacturer of finished goods. By importing raw materials from trade power, and exporting finished products, Sawul shall be able to turn a tidy profit. While you are busy at Sawul, one of your most valiant nomarchs is establishing a new trade center in Nubia. His city, Aiken, is likely to come under attack, so my beloved pharaoh should be prepared to send him any resources he may need. Under your rule, Sawul is sure to be one of the loveliest cities in the kingdom. Suitable as a final resting place for you and your family. As you establish the thriving port, do not neglect preparations for the afterlife. A mausoleum and small brick pyramid will provide sumptuous quarters for you and your family after your passage to the field of reeds. Alright. I think that this one's probably going to be pretty hectic, all things considered. So it looks like we have to use Meadow. I just end up with a Meadow Island here. Looks like we got gold. We have available here. Gold and copper. Okay. We do at least have clay. We can make the pottery. So that divides half the land already. This is probably where we would want to do granite, but I guess we're probably going to export that, I would assume. Yeah. Because if it's a brick pyramid, then we don't need that. So it looks like I'll be building about here-ish, or here. This is actually a very big area. To get 8,000 people, it's going to be a lot. The first thing I should do is definitely do that trade thing, getting the uh, gold in. Wait a minute, this, yeah. So I have to do enough to get weapons. So maybe I'll keep this area down here for the troops. And then I can make like any of the, the ships or whatnot that I might need send them off and then that way I can focus on food so the problem with getting it out here is that I I can't have access to water that way so really the housing blocks will have to be here so that they can connect to that without having to worry about the meadow or have meadow surrounding an area Alternatively, I could have this be farm surrounding industry and just have it all distribute straight over to the housing blocks here. That might work, too. Anyway, I'll plan it out. All right, we'll see how this goes. First thing we're going to need is a weapons industry and mining gold. The ability to mine gold will hopefully alleviate some of the early need for trade. Okay, we can probably shortcut that. 
Let's see. Nothing can go against those, right? That's all gonna be stone. That's all just sand. So how about we just draw a road like that? Hopefully now you'll be smarter about how you come in here. I mean, I could have just erased that, I guess, and then they would all just go diagonal, which would actually be the even shorter route, but whatever. So we'll allow our tradespeople to come in here a little bit faster. In fact, if we wanted to go even faster, faster, Really? Okay, well, that's a bummer, because this is actually shorter. So we've got three gods this time. Gotta make sure I'm keeping up with them too. heavy use of the meow cheat, I'm sure. I may as well shortcut this as well. First things first, the money situation. I don't know that I need a connection all the way out here, but I'm going to do it anyway. First things first is gold. I'm pretty sure I can only get four in here no matter what. I was playing around with it. It does not look feasible to get more than four in this corner. That'll be the first batch. And we'll need to get this palace down. You can go right there. Put a policeman right there. We can put like a obelisk or something. Now though, we still have more workers. Now, I think we might only actually need the four. I know I said I was going to put people over here to attack, but they don't. the The way it simulates stuff, it doesn't need that anymore. We could maybe put a boat over here still, but it doesn't need it. And that allows me to just make this whole line gold, uh, which should bring that in. So instead, we're going to come over here and get started. And this is another one where you can only get four in. Start with two, because those take... Ten apiece. And really, that could just sit right here. I don't think I need to do any kind of connection, but I will do that. Just for the appearance of it. If that road goes that way. You know what? undo that. Give myself just a little bit more space. I think I really only need about that much. Do 
story hard. Like that. Or that. So how big are these? The recruiter is a four, I'm pretty sure. The academy is anyway. Yeah. So let's take story yard here. So we'll accept weapons. And such we will need. Are they going to be pissed off already? No. Not yet. Maybe not even until I get the... the thing. I wish it would tell me exactly what I've got coming in here. Okay. Well, while that's baking... I mean, I could just do more. Um, I mean, I really could just do more. Like, this is the main thing right now get a bunch of money. <sighs> what else do we got here? We're gonna need weapons early on. Maybe I should focus on that. And rather than just cut myself off, a smart thing to do would be to loop this. So that I could have multiples. Because with four, we'll need at least four weapon makers but I can make more. So maybe we won't cut that off just yet. Right, because someone forgot half the shit to put down. It is wrong. Can't put that there now because of the way the platform is going to go. be like this. <coughs> this can just go up here. Okay. So this will be a main distribution area. I'm planning another one going this way, finish off this one, and then have a fifth one here. And uh, maybe more, but for now that'll work. 20 people. Three. All right. Mm, we need a festival square. Now we can hold the festival. Could probably do more. Through a party for all the gods, Ray. But not herself. It's actually kind of bad. I think the next industry we gotta do is pottery. Pretty much all the luxury goods, as was stated, but since we can make our own pottery, um, now, land, water, land, land, land. Okay, so there's two waters. One buys beer, the other only sells incense. I don't know how far I'm going to go with that. Now, I know that the culture is super high, or prosperity is culture too. We're just fucking ignore that. 
but for prosperity we need to be of a certain height in uh, in the tree so probably like right before it changes to estates I would say already huh well in that case perhaps we need to switch so if they're coming in here I would say we do it down here uh, that is a very far away from where I'm going to have my distribution hub, so maybe I'll have my distribution hub elsewhere. Could be right here, actually. I was, I think, originally planning on putting either the palace or the mansion here. Mansion won't go there, though, because it needs grass. Get its own water supply. So I could actually do that. It's just now this would be completely out of whack. I'd have to move all this stuff. Eh. But we can still put a few things here. Maybe. I mean, this side it won't do any good. Here would be the bottom of this end. Mm, I don't know. Um, anyway, yes, we have to get this going now. So we'll just work on it down here, I guess. And how far can these... That's the wrong thing. Granite is another item that we can sell a lot of, too. Okay. Bring it in like that. And I don't even know where to go with this. Sixteen, probably. And if we can do more, we'll do more. Now, we do happen to have meadow here. Like, I could do almost all of that stuff. Perhaps up here, though. If I do meadow along here for, like, flax. I don't have access to flax. I'm going to have to... Right, right, right. Uh, the dock, then. I mean, the dock is only necessary for the incense and reeds. Anyone else sell reeds? They sell flax. All right. Well, we need water specifically for that, then. So that'll be somewhere where I put the trading dock. But it can then be trade traded Maybe here, then it could just be brought in directly. I think this will only go to about here. I'm going to make that another block there. Okay. Uh, da -da -da. How many people, first of all? 100. Real good. I mean, I don't think I need nearly this many. But I, pottery is another trade good, though, so maybe I do. I don't think I need... Well, I do need brick, too. I can double down on a lot of the industry here. That will gap in the middle, then. So be it. Um, okay, well, in that case start the pottery there. Get at least three. Do not have anything being distributed here yet. So that'll be ready for that demand. Um, so we're going to need troops and weapons. So I guess maybe I should do a little bit of both right now. The academy down. Get the recruiter down. I can extend the road if I feel I need more. 
In fact, we are kind of seeing some copper guys just standing here, so why don't we speed that up? And then... Not you, not you, not you. Uh, infantry. Could I... Ooh, I can fit two in there. Very nice. Oh, the gods. This really cheeses me, actually. I could block it. Uh, uh, like that. No, the small one. So if I do, like, a, a block there... Maybe that'll force them through here? Where they don't care? Ray, she threw a comma on the bed. No. Ah! This. Okay, she included herself that time. I need somebody new off screen. <laughs> you bastards. This family. 46 people. All right. Aha, there we go. And now it's faster. Okay. Jeez. Give me a bowl. Okay. So this is as far as they can go. 47 people. A need another housing block just to get my base level to get this going. I mean, I, we may as well. Two, three, no. Two. I kind of like the idea of keeping that separate. So I can build off to the side there, so put all the little guys in here. Maybe get like a dentist right next to that or something. that money. We have got to start making money. Which I guess means that the next grouping after we get this food stuff going might end up being more gold smithing. So most of that though is con taken out of construction. So once once I stop building everywhere, we'll be fine. Didn't throw one for the rest of them. So much better. Things almost done. Hundred and fifty seven, all right. Now I'm gonna not no 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 save. I'm gonna save before I screw this one up. Because I'm gonna have to experiment with how I can make this fit.
So I was kind of looking, and it seems like if I start here... Doesn't actually go very far, does it? I don't know, is it more worth my time, do you think, just to Okay, now here's an idea. Right there. Either or, it doesn't exactly matter. We'll do this anyway, just because it's my... Uh, I mean, that road goes to something. Could go down here, too. So yeah, I think I'll probably have to have two. So maybe we can offset some of the bad appeal. I mean, like here, for example, I could actually just shove that in there. But we'll have an initial one here. You know what? Maybe if I... Mm, I don't think anything good would be there. Not really a reason to have them go down this way. Yeah, if I can think of a reason. Because I can put... Well, I can get two distribution centers here. But they'd be better off over here, where they're far away from the people. So why don't we do that, because we can still put one here, and then put like a statue or something to block appeal. We're going to need appeal blocking stuff, I think, to reach the higher ranks. So for now, that's good. Now, I'm eyeing religious buildings. If I do that, I'm going to need to put in another one. And this time, for some reason, they've given me access to everybody's temple complex. Interestingly, that would fit right inside there. Should probably do it, though. I mean, I don't know. How do the gods feel? Like, are we... We're not at a bad place. Population-wise, I'm not really sure. I'm sure somebody has written it down somewhere figured it out what the threshold population wise is yeah, nah, we'll just accept where we 
at workers. Get another one there, another one there. No way out here. I mean, the fertility, though, is the, the thing. I mean, like these guys are 45% fertile. I think food is going to be a much bigger issue than I really care to imagine. only getting half yields from all this crap so like a lot of it's gonna have to go down into this we may as well put them all in them now then oh we do have fishing we do have fishing well shit that is something I did not account for see now now who's ah. okay so, wharf. Wharf, wharf, wharf. Where the hell is the wharf? Can't fucking remember because they never keep anything related together. So we have to have a shipbuilder. Like it or not. That doesn't work. So that's going to have to go... Who sells wood? They do. Land route. Okay. God, I'm spending way too much money, though. Maybe, let, let's focus on this first. It's 20 people. Yeah, that was a little bit of a, an, over an expenditure there. We don't need that. We'll think about that, but really I, I should be focusing on what I've got so that I can then focus on more gold miners who will actually make me money. Five, twenty-six. Okay. Oh, they're still coming in, so I guess that is going to help. We might be reaching that population threshold. I need twenty-one hundred. Hot damn. It is far more than I was expecting. reach the threshold. The gods aren't happy anymore. Sixteen men. I stop spending money.
So far, that's all we've gotten out of the chickpeas. So, out of, out of no fault of my own, Shifting Sands, Mine Collapsed, Architects are powerless to stop it. So it's just the game screwing with me. Fifty people. Thirty-eight people. That's still a few more people, though. Harvest is in April. It's a bit tight. Just a bit tight. New trade route to Buhen. Where the fuck is that? Oh. Hiding. So they buy granite. So that's a tr water trade route too. All right, so we need to think about that. I could start selling copper directly. I've got enough weapons in the tank. But again, God, where do we put the, the dock? Like, the logical position would be here. But that's too... Like, I, I couldn't evenly do that, and... I think that's only two as well. And a shipwright, yeah. I think that's another one right there. If I pull this back, one, I can fit another fissure right there. Or go here. So basically have one long route that goes all the way here, and then we can put the dock over here. Okay. I mean, that works. That's very far away. It'd be better to have the ship right here and have the dock here. Yeah. That'll work better. Okay. Well. These guys don't turn off. But they're they should be full. They should be full, so let's let's Yeah, let's start doing that. Go to Buhen. Open a water trade route. Build the dock. Except copper. This is going to be our first juggling act here.
So disasters are the new thing, I guess. That's fucking great. Can we export pottery? I think the answer is yes. That should be the next thing. Except that, God, if he, if he wants 21 hundred in you know, six months or whatever, I'm going to be screwed on that. It's now April. We now have chickpeas. Let's get to distributing. Not going to work. Not going to work. Boy, I really fucked myself now. Guess I could block all that off. Having this right here would probably be the best idea. I really didn't leave myself room for extracurriculars in here. This is not going to be a very highly evolved house. Kidding me. This is going to be very fucking trying, isn't it? They sell papyrus directly. I don't think I could afford that. After we make it, though, can we sell it back to anyone? Yes. So it would behoove me to do so. All right. Okay. Well, bring it down to industrial way, I guess. I feel kind of stupid about this layout. Where the fuck is it? Except um, half of that. Keeping it, keeping it on a corner helps. Gets me more space, but then it's also further away when we need to actually distribute it. Ah. gonna do this. <laughs> this isn't gonna work. Like, I, I'm not gonna make it in this mission. I can already tell. There's just no fucking way. No, 
not papyrus. Port reads. I don't know. 800. 1200. We're waiting on people. Two. I'm sure there's going to be some fucking awful consequence for not getting that one mission done. Maybe I should do a little industrial corner over here instead, so it's all here and then just done and then back out. Or just have it line the inside here. That might be the smarter choice, actually. It's gonna take way too long for that shit to get down here. Egyptian city is under attack. Of course you are. How many do I need to send? That's the thing. I would assume as many as possible. But who actually knows? These are all weapons. I, the weapons aren't something I can sell, are they? I can. To whom? Anyone? You fucking lied to me. Like, there, there's composite bows, but those are not weapons. Those are a separate item. What in the fuck? I am looking for weapons. Open trade route to export. This is already exportable. Open trade route to export weapons. Buys. No weapons. I just gotta make sure, because sometimes I do get a little stupid and blind. I'm not fucking seeing it. Okay. Now well, we're gonna need a few more people. Pottery, right? We should be selling that. Available for import, not export. Of course, one of the biggest things that I am providing would not be available to give to people to sell. Makes no fucking sense in the world. Okay, well this is clearly not enough food. And when, well that's 99% fertile. 
but these ones are definitely not. So we need to bake, make a lot more. And I'm having a really hard time making that happen. So I guess it's either more housing blocks of these guys, or we wait another harvest to allow them to fill in. I have never had this much fucking trouble finding people. How the hell is that a thing? I guess because I've filled so much already with industry early on because I've been forced to because of the early demands. I could probably cut back on some of these people right now, actually, since that is full. I'm just <laughs> constantly fluctuate, I guess, adding and subtracting industries as I need them. I can already tell this is going to be my biggest fucking headache so far. I'm going to end this one here. I'll see you next time.